Hello traders. This is a slightly different kind of a video. I'm going to walk you through how you can um, recreate the NSE FNO um, entire list of stocks because at times stocks gets added and removed from the list. So if you are a futures trader, it's important that once a monthly contract concludes, you should you know, update your list. So how you can do that um, and how you can create that watch list on, uh, on your TradingView platform. You can create um, the Pine screener, the scanner, you can use it. So the first half will help anyone to create that watch list. And in the second half of this video, I will show you how you can create the state of flow positive as well as the negative watch lists. And this will directly help those who are part of Next Pro. So chale, without wasting much time, let's take a look at how we can get this done. Okay, so this is my um, trading view screen. I have the Pine screener tab open. And as you can see, I have the NSE FNO September 25 watch list. All right. Now I need to update this with the October 25 watch list. You can see on my right hand side, I have the same watch list open here. So these are the, this is essentially the entire list. First thing what I want to do is I want to open, um, let's say, a Google page on your browser and just type S, uh, NSE FNO list. Uh, when you hit enter, of course, you will get lots of search results. This is the one which is important. When you click on it, it will take you to NSE. Uh, let's understand, we can get this list uh, from multiple sources, right? Um, but it's always good to stick to the authentic source as much as possible. And what better than the National Stock Exchange website itself. So over here, you can see that on the top, there are um, indices and uske niche, this is the list of stocks. I wanted to do this in a slightly better manner, but uh, after trying a couple of ways, I figured out that simply they see, you know, select it and just copy paste it and paste it in a on an Excel sheet is the best way. So I've just selected the whole thing, right click and copy. And I'm going to open an Excel sheet, um, a blank one, just double click and open it. It has opened on my other screen. I'm going to drag it down here. I'm going to paste it, right? There you go. Now over here, you don't need, these two columns you don't actually need. You can just right click, select the whole thing and delete it. This is what we need. As of now, from 36.1, that is the first one, to the last one, Zydus Life, there's 209 stocks which are there in the FNO. Now, this is interesting and important. You go to File and you go to Save As. And when you come to Save As, it is important that you save it as a CSV format. And you can download every month I do this. So, I will have a list hoga. And uh, let me just say NSE FNO October 25 and done. Close this. You don't need this anymore. Now, you go back to your trading view. Go back to your trading view. And all that you have to do is essentially go to that list and export that CSV. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select Alt select the whole thing at my end, command A, select the whole thing and just hit delete and delete 209 names. It's all deleted. So my list is now clean. Go to the drop down and uh, import list. Can you see this import list? Click on the import list. Uh, go to downloads and over here it's a CSV file. And so I just need to scroll down and figure out where is it lying, the nifty CSV file. And it should be somewhere here. There you go. NAC FNO October, today 7.44. I created this, open. And there you go. The whole thing gets uh, added. 
एक चीज ध्यान रखिएगा जस्ट बी अवेयर ऑफ वन थिंग वन स्टॉक बजाज ऑटो इज रीनेम्ड डिफरेंटली अंडर ट्रेडिंग व्यू इट इज बजाज अंडर स्कोर ऑटो इसीलिए यहाँ पे इट्स नॉट शोइंग ऑल दैट यू हैव टू डू इज डिलीटेड एंड गो टू द प्लस साइन एंड मैनुअली एड बजाज ऑटो टू द लिस्ट एवरी मंथ आई हैव टू डू दिस Of course, uh, now it has become NAC FNO October 2025. I can uh, uh, favorite it. I can remove the FNO uh, September. I can remove it from my list. I can go to open list or the September ka jo um, watch list tha. I can just delete it. Done. Ab rahe gaya. Now I have the updated October 2025. This is a simple way, and like this you can actually import. any watch list directly from the nsc defined lists this i do uh, every month once a contract finishes and i move on to the next contract this was the first part of the of this video second part of the video is how can i mm, create my dedicated state of flow positive and negative watch list end of the week main samjhane ka koshish karta hu There are two zero nine stocks in the entire watch list, and we have a concept called state of flow (SOF). State of flow positive भी हो सकता है, state of flow negative भी हो सकता है. State of flow is essentially the tendency of the chart. जो bullish chart है उसमें हम long trades ढूंढेंगे, जो bearish chart है उसमें हम लोग short trade identify करने का कोशिश करेंगे. This is the thought process. Now state of flow I personally generally always calculate end of the week. So once the week is finished, over the weekend, I update my state of flow list. Now, how I do that? How am I going to do that? Let me show you. Those who are part of Next Pro, जिन के पास ये screener scanner है, Next का, you can directly uh, understand what I'm trying to show you. Those who are using pine screener and you have you may have your own concepts unko thoda bahut is process se fayda ho sakta hai first thing is the watch list the first thing is i have to select the watch list purana september 25 ka watch list hai so i'll i'll come to the drop down and now i can see over here can you see nsc fno october 25 the one that we created right now click on it there you go that's the nsc fno october 25 watch list then i have to come to the indicator Whatever indicators are there in your favorite, वो यहाँ पे दिखेगा आपको Those who use Pine Screener आपको पता होगा Over here I will come to my next bull scanner. This is our proprietary scanner. Okay? Uh, those who are, you know, using Trading View extensively और जिनको थोड़ा बहुत Pine um, आता है you know, coding, you can create multiple uh, screeners for yourself also. I will come to this drop down. I will go to one day, and I will change my settings to one week. And you can see these tabs. These are various proprietary scan logic, जो इसके अंदर है. Bullish scanner के अंदर there are multiple sub scanners. और मैंने उस time frame को daily से weekly में change किया. What do I need? What is my need of the hour? End of the week, I want to find state of flow. किसका state of flow positive है? इसको ड्रॉप डाउन करता हूं ट्रू करता हूं सो एन एस सी एफ एन ओ अक्टूबर ट्वेंटी के वॉच लिस्ट में बुलिश स्कैनर के कैटेगरी के अंदर ऑन द वीकली टाइम फ्रेम प्लीज टेल मी विच आर द स्टॉक्स विच हैव अ पॉजिटिव स्टेट ऑफ फ्लो पॉजिटिव स्टेट ऑफ फ्लो मीन्स द चार्ट इज इन अ नाइस अप ट्रेंडिंग फैशन दैट्स इट नो बाई नो सेल ओके डोंट मिस अंडरस्टैंड नाउ एल स्कैन आई हिट द स्कैन and it takes some sec few seconds and 60 stocks can you see this 60 stocks 60 stocks out of 209 stocks within the fno are in a positive state of flow now i have already created few watch list agar aap yahan pe ye green dot ke taraf agar aap dekhenge over here i have already created a watch list i named it weekly sof positive har week ke end mein i recreate this so what do i have to do i have to select the whole thing and i have to delete it ye last week ka tha now i have to come to this new list 60 stocks select the whole thing right click add 
to the weekly SOF positive. I select it. There you go. As you can see, wo 60 stocks yahan pe aage. So I have my bullish category, a bullish list ready from the weekly point of view. If I've done the bullish, I should get done with the bearish also. So I come here and I reset this. I come down here and I remove this. Bullish scanner se nikalne ke baad, I come down to the bearish scanner. I come down to the bearish scanner and I click on one day and I change it to one week. Now listen, I can do it one week, one month. End of the month, I month karta hon, end, on the, end of the week, I week karta hon. Daily rozana karne ka zarurat nahi hai. It does not fit my style of trade. So on the weekly time frame, I will do the same thing. I'll come to state of flow true. I'll cross check. Yes, weekly hai. Bear scanner hai. FNO October 25 ka watch list hai and state of flow negative true hai. All that I have to do now is hit scan. I hit scan and again out of 209 stocks, 69 stocks are negative. Aap sochenge 69 or 60, 129, baaki ka kya mein kha gaya? Well, they are neither positive nor negative. They are in a not a well-defined state of flow. They are flat. So, uh, I will now come to my red dot. Over here, that is the weekly SOF negative. Ye purana wala list hai. Select karunga the whole list. Delete and yes, out. Come to this list. Select the whole thing. Right click. Add selected watch list. Weekly SOF negative. Ye aagya mera entire weekly negative watch list. I can open my, <coughs> my template. And this is my monthly, this is my weekly. And go to my list of positive. Few Adani names are there. And I can cross check. Agar aapko dikhega, mein kaam karta hon. My weekly chart ko zoom out kar deta hon. This is my weekly time frame. Aur ye raha state of flow negative. Like this, all the stocks over here, Hindustan Aeronautics, Can Bank, Idea, everyone are in a positive state of flow. The red dot is giving me a negative state of flow. So I can see Ambuja Cement has moved into a negative state of flow. Federal Bank has moved into a negative state of flow, etc, etc. Before I end this video, just because the state of flow is positive or just because the fact that the state of flow is negative does not mean or guarantee that it's a long trade or a short trade. It just talks about the state in which it is flowing on the downside or on the upside. Whether there is a short trade or a long trade, it depends on the next category. That is whether you have a proper trigger, does it fit into any setup or strategy, what is the kind of risk that setup is giving you, etc. etc. Okay, so let me know whether this video would have helped you. If you are into Next Pro, definitely this will help. You already knew that. I'm just recreating so that it, it helps anyone who joins afresh. And if you are a user of TradingView and if you're using the pine screener aspect of TradingView, this is just a look and feel of what all you can create using this amazing software. Okay, till then, take care of yourselves. Goodbye. Trade well.